Hello guys, welcome to the tutorial No Red for Dummies edition note by note and today I am going to explain you how to use the note HTTP and well in the description as you can see here it says it helps to create an HTTP endpoint for creating web services so this note is going to help us to interact between a web page and no red and today I am going to give you an example of how you can use it well first of all before that we need uh, to create a web page or we need a web page from where to get the information and I am going to explain you right now how to make a simple a simple one with HTML and I would like you to type this code on your computer you can make it on your notepad you can pause the video and type it and when you will you will be done you can save it as an html file like this do not save it just like that because it will be saved as a text and we need the file to be in html so after you save it you need to know where it it will be located okay so actually what let's let's check first of all how it would look in the browser and right now we are going to to set up a local http server with python and for making that i need you to have python installed and you are and with the help of python we are going to set up a local a local http server like this you are going to click here execute cmd and you are going to call to copy that code here clicking in enter and the server is running right now and then you are going to to open your localhost server on your web browser well in my case is in, in chrome and here you can get access you can get access to your files from your web browser and what you need to do is actually look the location where where the HTML, html file was stored here on your computer as I told you, I need you to save it as an HTML file and not as a text. And when you click here, you can observe the, the web page that we have created that is actually hosted in our local server. So let's check the code. Well, this code is actually for the, for the title and I am using the color dark red. And here we are going to perform an, perform an action and we are going to, to post actually in this link. And well, this link will be created with the help of no red and we will check how to, how to do it. It's actually a, a test link that the node HTTP allows us to use. And let's check how to how to make it. And you can come here and type test. And well, today we are going to use the method post for perform this perform that action. You can see here post. In another videos, I am going to explain you how to use get, put, delete, and patch. But today we will stay just with post and we click in down here and we get a debug note just to to check if the information will arrive correctly so let's deploy and let's send some, let's type some text here so we can make hello no red for example we are sending it to no red. You can see it's arriving via the HTTP node, and you can see here in 
in the debug screen that is arriving correctly here. Hello, no red. Let's try it with with text and numbers. I don't know any numbers like this. Okay, it works. And just with numbers, I don't know, random numbers. And is arriving correctly as you can as you can see it. So what we are doing actually it's uh, it's making a making a link with with no red that would look like like this actually you can type this actually the the link is is here is uh, localhost well localhost is the same as 127.0.0.1 it's the it's the same as localhost and not red no red is helping us to to creating the the complete link with this node just adding the test here and replacing that here and well with the other examples you will get a better understanding of how this works but today as i said we will stay just with post method let's add the same dashboard to check if it works okay let's let's check if it arrives in text okay so let's make a, well i did it already but you can name it like that test, test http test http update you can put that here as well. Clicking done. Then you are gonna go to dashboard. Well, I like the this the dark the dark style actually. You can choose between them. And after that, you can click here in the arrow. And okay, let's deploy it. Of course, you can see here the, the dashboard and. Let's send some send some text. I don't know. And text. Okay. Okay, it's arriving here. Right now we need to get rid of, of this. And we can make it like it comes actually from here because here we are saving it like this as a as a name and a, and a value, but I am going to ex explain you very fast how to get rid of the of the name and just get the value so we create a function right now we connect that here and okay we are going to type g dot no, it's here payload going to be equal ESG payload ESG payload and just type it name because it's it's what we are entering here it's, it's what we are entering here so you will see okay let's first Deploy it and let's check if it if it works. You know, new message, for example. Okay, it's it's cleaner now. And well, you can try as well with something else in the in the dashboard. I don't know with what what we can try today with a chart maybe. Let's check it with a chart. Instead of a text, and okay, everything is right there. Test, test. Okay. The axis. I don't know. Maybe we can go from zero to to twenty. Let's check how it will be deployed in the dashboard. And let's. Insert the insert some value, some numbers for example. Six. Oh, it's well, it's this is entering numbers according to time. 
okay you can see here it's changing according to time and well that that can help you to build some nice interfaces for for your projects let's make it smaller too for example two. you can see it's here so it's how you can use it for making a link between a web page and, and from the link you need you have here the the link of the, of the web page as I, as I told you and yeah that's a, an example of how you can use the, the note HTTP so I hope you like the video and please subscribe if you like the video and I will be explaining in other videos how the how the other methods work and if you have any doubts you can comment it and I will reply as soon as possible goodbye